This is how you do the J. Joe. The most important step for the J. Joe is deciding if you want a point for the sideburns, a low taper, or a high taper. Now, it is your choice, but for this model, he has no choice because for this video, we wanted to do a carbon copy of the J. Joe. Now, to hide our five head, we want to make sure we trim the fringe just enough to reach the eyebrow bone. Now, we're not looking for that Billy Ray mullet, so we want to make sure we use a feather razor to create that wispy texture and reduce the length. Tease and pinch the texture in place, and there you go.